happening today. Two new festivals could get the ticket to become the next Virginia Beach uh, Festival next summer. That's right. One would take place on Something in the Water's traditional weekend. The other on the weekend that used to host Patriotic Festival. Ten on your side's Brett Hall joins us live from the oceanfront with more on both of them and how much they are looking for in taxpayers' help. Brett? Katie and Asia, yeah, so no one's really wants to be out on the beach right now, although it's a pretty sight. It's quite chilly out here, but because they are already starting this task force that is trying to look at how they should spend money on festivals, a lot of people are wondering, well, then why are you moving forward with looking at new festivals now? Well, according to Vice Mayor Rosemary Wilson, they need to make actions on these now in order for the festivals to be up on time. Now let's talk about those festivals. The first one, which will occur the last weekend in April, the traditional something in the water weekend, would be put on by Odyssey. Odyssey is the communications company that owns radio stations in Hampton Roads as well as across the country. They tried to put on a festival last year, but it was not coming together, so they pulled the plug in October. But now it's going to be held on this fourth weekend in April. We don't know the exact music, but last time when they were looking to do the festival, they said an artist like uh, Third Eyed Blind, something like that. So that festival, again, the last weekend in April will be held around 31st Street, and they are looking for $750,000 to help with advertising for the festival. The city council will consider that tonight. The other festival that's being considered would be hosted on May 31st, June 1st, and June 2nd, and it would be down at 3rd Street to 6th Street, and it would be a reggae festival. Now, you may remember a lot of people remember the American Music Festival that went on Labor Day weekend for years. That often had reggae artists. I spoke with Ken McDonald of I Am Going. He'd be putting on this new festival, and he said it is the right theme for the beach. They are asking for $300,000 up front and then to keep all the admissions, ticket sales, kind of like something in the water and beach it did. Now, on something in the water, I talked to the hotel association president down here, John Zirkel, and he told me that the hotels, they are disappointed. It's not coming back. It's traditional weekend, but they are happy that the city is still going to have programming that weekend. Now, I know a lot of people are asking when is something in the water going to be, and the official festival announcement is going to come from the festival, but several sources I've been speaking with say look for much later in the year, maybe even the fall. We're live at the Virginia Beach Oceanfront. Brett Hall, 10 on your side.